हेलो चिल्ड्रेन आई वेलकम ऑल द स्टूडेंट्स ऑफ क्लास वन टू मैथ्स ऑनलाइन क्लास आई होप यू ऑल आर डूइंग गुड सो टुडे वी आर गोइंग टू कंटिन्यू विद द सेम चैप्टर दैट इज नंबर्स अप टू ट्वेंटी चैप्टर नंबर वन नाउ टुडे वी आर गोइंग टू डू द टॉपिक ग्रेटर देन लेस देन एंड इक्वल टू ऑल राइट so once more i repeat the topic greater than less than and equal to okay the symbol for greater than is this one okay this is the symbol for greater than and this is the symbol for less than and this is the symbol of equal to right children i hope it is clear to you now let me explain in more detail about it that is see greater greater than numbers how you are going to find out the greater than numbers it is easy there is a technique to find out that means you can use the help of your right hand you should not be confused which is the symbol of greater than and which is the symbol of less than okay so your Le right hand when you when you keep your right hand this way in this method you you look at the pointer children in this method okay so the opening the opening of this part okay that means it the the mouth of this one no that is open towards isn't it towards the bigger number so your right hand if when you do your right hand this way it shows that it is a uh, greater than symbol now when you use your left hand to do the same it shows the less than symbol all right so now here you see how you will are going to find out greater than or less than see first this is having two digit numbers two digit numbers so what you will do first you will see the tens place okay here the tens place is 45 and here the tens place is 2 that means 4 is greater than 2 that means 45 is greater than 23 in the same way this one 6 this is also two digit number so you have to see the tens place so this is 6 and this is 5 in this case also 6 is greater than 5 so 67 is greater than 50 in the same way less than how you are going to find out see here also it is of two digit here also two digit okay so now you are see, going to see the tens place here it is 2 here it is 4 okay so that means 4 is greater isn't it 4 is greater and 2 is less so what you are going to write 28 is less than 40 isn't it now here same way two digits 54 and 76 two digit numbers so we are going to see the tens place So tens place here it is five and tens place here it is seven. Okay, so which one you are going to see? You are going to um, see the five is smaller and seven is greater number. So that means fifty four is smaller than seventy six. Okay, if it is same digit, then you will see the ones place. okay now we will do some more questions regard related to then it will be more clear for you okay related to greater than less than and equal to now 5 this is only one digit number so 5 is greater or 3 is greater 5 is greater than so that means our right hand symbol isn't it right hand symbol the right part the mouth should be opened okay so with the hand, what the your right hand shows that symbol will come here now the second question is Eight is this is this is one digit number. Eight is one digit number and twelve is two digit number. So definitely one digit number is smaller than two digit number. So it is eight is less than. So this is the opening of your left hand finger. Okay. Now the third one seventeen and eight. So here two digit number and it is one digit number. So always two digit number is greater than the one digit number. So the symbol will be like this. So the this question is thirteen 
here also two digits here also two digits both are 13 so it is very easy we all know that it is equal now here you see children 7 and 16 7 is one digit number 16 is two digit number so definitely two digit number is greater so opening should be towards the 16 that means 7 is less than 16 okay now here again 6 and 6 that means 6 is equal to 6 now here 9 is single digit number and 12 is two digit number that means 9 is smaller than 12 or you can say 12 is greater than 9 okay now here see both the, these digits are two digit number 20 and 15 so what you will see what you will do here you will first see the two digit number okay that means you will see the tens place that means tens place here it is two and here the tens place is one that means two is greater than one that means 20 is greater than 20 is greater than 15 all right children these are just examples for you i have taken it from outside you don't have to write it okay you just understand it now we are going to learn about uh, comparing numbers okay or uh, order of numbers order of numbers means uh, ascending order and descending order okay so as increasing order you can say it as increasing order okay Ascending order is also known as increasing order. That means ascending order means arranging the numbers from smaller to the bigger number. See, the numbers are arranged from smaller to the bigger, isn't it? See, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. Okay, so this is arranging the numbers from smaller to bigger or in ascending order. Now, when you arrange the numbers from bigger to smaller, so the arrow, now you have to follow this arrow. Okay, in ascending order, we were going up, so this follow, this arrow. Now, we are going down, okay. So, descending order means, descending order means what? To come down, okay, or arranging the numbers from the greatest to the smallest. From the greatest to the smallest that means we have to now see like go backwards that means 10 9 8 7 6 5 4 3 2 and 1 okay children i hope it is clear for you once more i repeat it increasing order or ascending order means arranging the numbers from smallest to the greatest and descending order or descending or decreasing order means arranging the numbers from greatest to the smallest okay children i hope it is clear now let us do uh, this sum okay one two examples i have taken so here only we will do both the ascending and the descending okay so now you tell me which is the first we are going to do First, we are going to do the ascending. Ascending ascending means smallest to the biggest, isn't it? So, let us first do ascending order. Okay. Now, which is the smallest number? The smallest number here is see 40752 so of course the first smallest number is 0 then 2 then 5 will then 4 will come then 5 then 7 isn't it now here the smallest number is 9 single digit number so 9 the next will be 11 then 13 then 16 and then 19 so let us write it okay First is what? 0, then 2, then what is the next number children? Yes, it is 4, very good, try, yes, then the last number is 
7. So here the smallest number is 9, then it is 11, then 13, then what is the next number children? Then it is 16 and the last number is 19. Right? So in the same way, this is we have arranged the numbers from ascending to descending. Now we are going to arrange the same numbers from descending. Okay, that means from uh, descending, uh, from smallest to the biggest first we have done. Now we will be doing from biggest to the smallest. That means in decreasing order. Okay, so first one, the biggest one is 1. 7 will come here. Then 5. Then 4. Yes, children. Then next is 1. 2, very good, and 0. So the second one, how you are going to do? The second one is, which one will come first? 19 is the biggest number, so 19 came first. Then, yes, very good, 16. Then 13, very good children. Then the next number is 11, and the last number is 9. I hope it is clear students. Okay. So if it is clear. That is okay. Now we are going. Please take out your book. Page number 15. Okay. In page number 15. Uh, the, the mental maths you write it down. Okay. This is. You have zero tails. How many tails you have got children? You don't have any tails. Isn't it? Only animals has got tails. So you are going to write here. Zero. Okay, now number two, you have five fingers in both of your hands. That means in the first finger also, in the first hand you have five fingers and in the second hand also uh, five fingers. Left hand five fingers, right hand five fingers, total ten fingers. Okay, now the greatest one digit number is nine. After nine it is ten, ten is having two digits, isn't it? So, 9 is the greatest one digit number. Now, the numbers after 8 but before 12. So, that means after 8 before 12 means between. Between what are the numbers? You have to write down. Okay. So, the numbers are 9, 10 and one more number should be there. It, is, it has not come here. Okay, then cut. I will write it here. You write it down. Okay, you write in the gap 11 also you write children. Okay, the numbers after 8 are uh, after 8 but before 12 are 9, 10 and 11. Okay, now number 5. There are 4 numbers between 15 and 20. So, you count 15 and 20. What are the numbers? 16, 17, 18 and 19. That means 4 numbers. In the same way, the last one, there are 11 2-digit numbers up to 20. So, how many 2-digit numbers? 2-digit numbers starts from 10, isn't it? So, you count 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20. How many you got children? 11, isn't it? So, 11 is the answer. Okay. I hope you enjoyed the class children. You understood I suppose. So, all of this much in today's online class. Thank you so much. Have a nice day.